I'm Keith Peters with the Palo Alto Weekly. With me is Drew Edelman, a junior on the Menlo School basketball team. Last week, uh, Drew played in three games. She averaged 24.3 points a game, 18.3 rebounds a game. Menlo won two of the three games, both in the Menlo Holiday Classic Tournament. She had a game high of 30 points, 27 rebounds in one of the games. And for that performance, she is the Palo Alto Weekly Girls Athlete of the Week. Uh, good start for the team this year. You guys are off to a 2 1 start. 30 points, 27 rebounds against Mount Pleasant. Uh, I guess the team was looking for you uh, in that game. Yeah, well, their team wasn't uh, very tall. Their team was mainly a bunch of short girls. And we have a really good point guard who's just crazy about assists. She just throws me the ball every time she sees me open. So I was open a lot because they're so short. So, What's the uh, the plan for this year's team? Uh, you've uh, John Pay is back as your as your head coach. Uh, is it a, is it a faster team this year? Or is it team different than last year? Well, the team's a lot different. Uh, we lost five girls, so we you know a lot less people returned, and our team's kind of small and inexperienced. But we're a really athletic group of kids, and I think a lot more practice will end up being a lot better than most people think we can be. Has your role changed at all on this year's team? Or are you going to be more of, a, 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 again, a go-to person where if they need a quick basket or, a, you know, a, a, they have to get the ball inside, obviously, uh, to start things off. But uh, has, has this changed your role at all? Um, I don't think so. I'm still, I mean, I'm still like the same post player. If they need a quick go-to pass in the center, I'm there. So. And they, as far as the, the outlook for this year's uh, season and uh, and postseason uh, what uh, what kind of expectations do you think uh, there are uh, for you guys this year um, I think our team definitely has chances of winning in league we're a bunch of really fast girls and they're super athletic and they can all jump really high and they're all like multi-sport girls so I think we can definitely win league if we you know play hard at practice and reach our full potential and you know who knows maybe we could do better than that but I think we have you know a good chance of going far I think with, uh, I mean, Pinewood's graduated a lot of players off their uh, state championship team, and Castilea seems to be down, and Sacred Heart is Sacred Heart, and uh, so it seems like this might be a good year for you guys to uh, finally make a big move. Yeah, I do think so. Um, I know Pinewood got a good point guard freshman, but I also think, you know, we have good point guards, we have good wing players, and a lot of the teams have graduated all their really good senior players, so hopefully, you know, we can beat them now. Good luck the rest of the way. Congratulations. Thank you.